progress. About the uh, Willie Willie said, you know, you guys talked uh, a couple of days back maybe about just continuing to be aggressive. Uh, you know, I guess what can you just just share about that and like um, how comfortable are you feeling in the offense right now? Uh, very comfortable. Always, you know, we play a pretty easy, you know, get get open shots, drive, kick, you know, make the right plays. Um, and yeah, he just had a talk with me the other day. Uh, just about being aggressive, looking for my shot more. Um, obviously, I was struggling. The ball wasn't going in. So, you know, I was playing a little frustrated. I told him I was a little frustrated. But that was just, you know, personal stuff. So uh, he told me, just keep letting it fly. So that's what I'm doing. I know, uh, look, Zion's a guy who attracts a ton of attention, driving kick game. Um, you know, you just haven't had that this year. Creating looks for you. Has that, has it been an adjustment? Like, has it, has it been different than, than what, what you thought it would be? Has what been an adjustment? Like right. just, just um, you know, not having, like, that guy to, to play off the driving kick. Uh, no, not necessarily. I mean, we got guys that do it. Herb does a great job. Obviously, B.I. draws a whole bunch of attention. Josh Hart getting downhill. Um, we got guys that, you know, can get downhill. It's just my job to find those open windows and, and, and give them, you know, an outlet. So, um, when they drive, I just try to, you know, put myself in that position. Yeah, and, and to that point, I mean, you guys are 6-3 and three with the starting group now. Um, you know, just what is the chemistry like with you all out there, you think? Well, it's good. You know, we got to... Just keep it going. Keep everybody keep being aggressive. Guys are stepping up and, and making big plays, um, and, and definitely loving it. You know, like I said, we got a good group of guys, and we're gonna just keep fighting. Yeah, we know how much you love shooting that three ball. How much do your eyes light up when you see a team playing zone uh, as they did tonight? <laughs> uh, it always lights up. Uh, I told him in the locker room, uh, high school I used to call we called the zone buster. So uh, anytime I seen a team going zone, you know, I just try to find those windows and, and get them up. Yeah, and we talked about it a lot this year, but how much uh, of an impact do you think Herb and Josh made tonight, just being those guys do all the little things on the court allow, you know, UBI and mm -hmm. JV to be the scorers on offense? Uh, huge, man. Uh, like I said, Josh defensively and Herb defensively, you know, they don't get enough credit for what they do for us. Um, you know, guarding one through five, basically. Um, and making it tough on guys. Um, and then offensively, they even even better, you know, getting downhill. It's a, so it's a lot of work for both of them. So you got to give them a lot of credit. Yeah, these are back-to-back -back games where you guys were able to execute down the stretch and come away with a close win. Just how important is that uh, just when you guys have struggled in those situations so much this year? Well, uh, it's good. I mean, it's showing that, you know, we're learning and, and – we're getting better in that area, which is going to be huge for us. Like I said, as long as we put ourselves in that position uh, down the stretch, you know, we got guys that can make those plays and, you know, finish the game. Just to, you've obviously been a really big part of uh, two consecutive wins now. Um, not just the 61 footer, but obviously we're shooting on the previous game too. But um, how do you feel? Do you feel like? These last two games are an example of what should be maybe more of a normal influence on the game from you. Uh, what you mean, like how I should be playing? Well, what what you expect of your your production uh, to be? Oh, and, oh okay. And, and your contribution in, in in the team. I mean, not necessarily, uh, you know, leading the team and scoring every night, but mm -hmm. making those kind of clutch shots and hitting. I mean, you're over fifty percent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I mean, obviously you can't shoot a ball like that every game. Um, and I've been talking with a couple of my coaches, you know, you can't base base all your play off of making shots. So I never try to just be like, oh, I got to make eight threes a game or, you know, there's a lot of ways that I can impact the game. Um, so I just try to come out and be solid, man, make the right plays, get guys open. And then when I'm open, you know, make, take the shots and, and shoot them with confidence, whether they're going in or not. Monte, having these two games like you've had these past two, does that do anything for you typically? Like in the past, when in the career, when you get suddenly hot, do you feel like you've discovered something? You feel like you can ride at them for a while? Oh, uh, you know, you just try to ride the wave. You know, you get hot and, you know, you just try to stay as hot as you can for as many games as you can. Uh, keep that confidence. Like I said, it's always going to be there, but you can't always make shots the way you do um, every night. So, uh, 
just try to try to stay with it, stay in the gym, keep getting up shots, and, and keep keep my teammates do a great job of finding me. So appreciate y'all. Zone Buster High School. Zone Buster. Oh, man.